Gandhi. I have fears of taking off my shirt. <laughs> when I was younger, I had the body of Gandhi, and I was ashamed. Now I look like his drunk, illegitimate grandson, a divorced truck driver with a beer belly, and I'm still ashamed. I act like I'm just leasing this body, like it's not really mine, so why should I be proud of it? Whoever created it has to be pissed. He doesn't take care of anything. That's why I won't give him anything nice. Maybe I'll ask him how much it costs to replace, and then when I'll have to give it back. When will we own ourselves completely? I ask my wife as I drink a Pepsi. I keep forgetting to relax my forehead and wear sunscreen to stop grinding my teeth. I should have kept my receipt for these wrinkles and bloody gums. I keep forgetting to stop the midnight snacking and the Taco Bell's idea of fourth meal was good for business but bad for mortality. I remember learning about the tree of life, but what about the tree of love? <laughs> it grows, it dies, and some people fall out of it. I keep forgetting that my wife still has the option for divorce, that she didn't fall in love with me while I was wearing sweats. So tonight, I'll make a new vow. Like Gandhi said, I'll change. I just hope tonight's not the last time I'll see the light. <laughs>